Hey Miranda Miner, this is Coach Miranda Miner and welcome to another edition of Coach Miranda Miner Learning Series. Now, this is a special series kung saan Coach Miranda Miner will be talking about is it time? Is it time to declare independence sa yung work today? No, Is it time to resign and do full-time crypto trading? No, Let me give you some tips that you need to consider uh, bilang uh, crypto trader before you even make that decision of resigning, no? All right, quick. Uh, tip number one. Make sure you have six to nine months worth of your savings, no? Mahalaga yan, mahalaga yan because uh, worth of your savings equivalent into your fixed cost. Now, so, for example, pakita ko lang sa inyo ng mabilis, no? Mabilis lang na, for example, in a month, Umaabot ka, let's say, ng amortization ng iyong bahay at ng iyong kotse, 50,000. Tuition fee ng mga anak mo, 5,000 pesos. Utility cost, 10,000. You know, uh, mobile phone, oriente, tubig, association dues, etc. Kung meron man. Insurance fee, 2,000 pesos. Groceries and fuel, maliit na yung 10,000. Bayad mo sa yaya mo, 8,000 per month. And of course, ang total ng fixed cost mo per month, ilagay mo na yung 5,000 emergency fund mo. It's 90,000 pesos per month. No? And then, of course, a total of total of uh, around 9 months, aabot ng, uh, aabot ng mga around 810,000 know, ang iyong kailangan savings no? before ka pumunta sa iyong bagong gig. No? Important yan. No? Important yan because hindi lang naman um, you know, fixed cost. No? Of course, you've noticed na lagyan ko rito ng other emergency cost because totoo yan. You know, from from a real life scenario, marami tayong mga bagay na kailangan mo i-consider before ka mag uh, let go ng iyong uh, uh, mahal na trabaho. Alam ko nakaka-stress, no? It's very stressful, but you know, I just want to make sure I give you the reality of things, no? Dan sa bundong ito bawat galaw mo merong gastos, no? All right, and of course, you need to consider ang tinatawag nating number 2, you know? Have a health and insurance coverage. No? Sa panahon ngayon, kapag ikaw ay walang insurance coverage, malaki ang uh, problema mo. Right? Because either A, you know, wag naman po sana and something happens. No? Maraming sa mga tao ngayon na kahit napakaraming pera, they end up selling their hard assets like their cars, their, their, uh, you know, their house, their property because they have no health coverage. They have no health coverage. They have no insurance. Tatandaan ninyo, ang insurance is really, really important in crypto trading. Yan ang tinatawag nating foundation of an effective crypto trader. Kasi kung wala kang insurance, you know, you don't you don't go to speculative trading. Tinuturo yan ni Coach Miranda Miners sa kanyang personality assessment. If you score below 17 sa assessment niya, you're not gonna be for crypto trading. So important yan, kaya you need to have a health insurance coverage and you need to have fill health, you need to have at least HMO, right? Kasi you would never know, there could be other things that we would never know, right? And then another tip, no, baka kasi nabuboard ka lang. No? Let's go to um, random minor tip number three. Baka in your current job today, baka you just feel that uh, it's not meeting your skills or your needs and you, you're just demotivated, no? So don't declare independence yet from your work. Find another job that meets your skills, no? Meets the culture na pwede ka na isa kang in, uh, you know, that you could explore your creativity, you know, bilang empleyado. You know, you could further harness your skill set, no? And find that, you know, look for your career appetite and look for that environment. Don't just give up agad, no? Find another alternative job because kung masaya ka lang uh, in your salary, Right? Hindi ka masaya sa trabaho mo. Masaya ka lang two times in a month, which is your salary day, the quincenas katapusan. And that's not what you would want, no? That's not what you would want. Alright? Kasi, you know, there are other potential work na kailangan mong pwedeng mangyari, no? Na hindi mo lang siguro nakatagpuan pa. And maybe a change of environment can help you, no? Alright? Another tip, tip number four, no? Grow business on the side muna. Huwag ka munang umalis, no? While on the side, do a side gig. Maganap ka muna ng side gig that could be a passive income for you. For example, crypto trading, cryptocurrency trading, no? If you build on your winning habits, build on your trader's quotient, para at least on the side, you're trading, 
you're earning. Ang, ang maganda na sa cryptocurrency ka because you know, because sa, sa minsan sa stock market walang volume na ipon iip, yung pera mo. But in the cryptocurrency trading, your money is very it, the money is liquid. The flow exchange of hands is really liquid. Right? So grow a business on the side, either it is a manufacturing business or small sari-sari store business, a small tindahan, loading sis, loading business, GCash business, I don't know. It's up to you. Right? So at least when you declare independence sa yung trabaho, then you have a passive income that could supply, you know, supply your another thing is real estate could be paupahan, magbigay ka ng uh, let's say anim na pinto, no? Anim na pintong paupahan sa iyong property sa iyong lote. Then 5,000 per month, that's already almost 30,000 uh, per month kung anim na butas or anim na pinto yan. Oh, 30,000 per month, where will you get that? Diba? Just grow a business on the side, have a passive income. No? Ngayon, kung hindi pa din, baka naman sa board mo nabuburyong ka lang. No? Here on the tip number five, take a breather. Go to the countryside if possible. Countryside, not country size, I mean. Go to the countryside. Look for, go to the province kung pwede. Kaya nga sabi ko, if possible. Kung wala nang quarantine. Find, find your center, reflect. Find yourself, no? Breathe in, breathe out. Go to the vitamin C. Sabi nila sa dagat, vitamin C. No, smell the breeze of the ocean. No, smell the flowers. Kung baga, you know, take the moment of pause. Pause ka muna. Baka sobrang bilis mo kasi. Sobrang bilis mong uh, career person. Wala naman nakikipagunahan sa'yo. Life is a marathon, not a sprint. No? Now, another one is find a habit or hobby. No, Miranda tip number six, no? Pagkatapos nung number five natin, break, take a breather. You also find a hobby. Could be car collection. It could be, you know, collecting other things, no? Or baking your baking a cake, no? Find a hobby. Find a diversion. Para yung stress mo sa work, hindi na uubos sa puro work. And karamihan sa mga single kasi wala kayong outlet of stress. No? Wala kayong anak. No? So build a hobby, no? Learn. Okay, sa, sa videos ni Coach Miranda Minor. Ang dami kong videos. Make it a habit to listen and go to my 10 o'clock live, no? Para hindi kayo nabuburyo, no? Alright, and of course, before you resign, tip number seven, think of your family, not just yourself. <coughs> Advance ka mag-isip bilang tatay, bilang nanay. Think of your family kasi your family will rely on you, no? Hindi lang ikaw, lumalaki yung mga anak mo. Think of that as a future investment. No? Future investment. Right? And then not as last last but not the least, tip number eight, if you really want crypto trading to be your source of income in the future, then you need to invest on learning. Invest ka on learning, you need to learn. I mean, invest on your time. There's a lot of free learning in my YouTube playlist. Don't just invest on your time and learn and learn and learn. No? So again, before you just submit that resignation letter, you know, think of the eight, think of those eight um, habits. Make sure you have uh, six to nine months worth of your savings. Make sure you have a health coverage. Maybe change your alternative job. You know, grow a business on the side. Take a breather. Go to the provincia if possible. Find a hobby. Think of your family, not just yourself. And last but not the least, grow your learning. Learn more. Learn and grow. You know, learn and grow in the business. Right? If you really think that cryptocurrency trading is your, is your next step. All right? So I hope nakatulong sa itong video na to. Maraming salamat. And uh, please don't resign yet. No? Think about it many, many times. And of course, pray, reflect, and ask for wisdom and knowledge. No, ask for discernment. And uh, you know, I'm sure that uh, you know our uh, our faith will help us find our sin. All right. With that said, thank you, thank you so much. And I hope this is something na nakatulong sa yung this Independence Day. Thank you.